Hello everyone, this is Rebecca one slash noobs here, and I'm here to give you another Helper's Corner tutorial. Now, this Helper's Corner tutorial will cover on computer parts, more specifically the RAM. I'm not sure if this will help in CPU. Yeah, I'm going to cover RAM. Now, the reason why I'm covering RAM is I just recently bought like four sticks of RAM. Okay, they look skinnier than this, but like... Yeah, you get my point. I bought four sticks of RAM, and in the beginning I had uh, four gigs of RAM, and now I have eight. Now, when I go to my task manager, it said I was only using 3.84 gigs of RAM out of four. Now, that was confusing, because I just added four more gigs of RAM to my computer, right? Because you know you'd expect that eight sticks or no uh, four sticks that equal up to eight gigs of RAM would have given me eight gigs and for some reason the computer only recognizes four gigs half of what it's supposed to be I, I am here to actually show you on how to fix that problem in case if you ever run into it by showing you on how to do it on Windows if you're doing this for Mac, I am not familiar with Macs at all, so please check another tutorial. If it's for like Macs or Linux or Vista, I'm not sure if, like Vista seems pretty close to Windows, but yeah, I don't know. But you can try. What I want you to do is go to your start menu and actually uh, click on run and type in msconfig, press OK, and then you'll get this pop-up window. Now, what you want to do is click Boot, Advanced Options, and if you uh, look at this, like if you never mess with the Advanced Options, this would be checked. You do not want this to be here. Like, I don't know why, and I don't know how, but somehow this was like holding back my computer, and I guess like. I don't know, just unticking it helped, and it made it so the computer recognizes how much RAM I have. Because it said in the startup that I have 8 gigs, but it was only using 4 gigs. So if you untick the max memory, then just press OK and apply, then you'll be using 8 gigs of RAM. Make sure you restart the computer right after you apply it. So if you ever have you know problems with RAM and it says that it's not using all the RAM just follow what I did go to MS config and untick it so that way it just uses every single bit of RAM that you've bought I hope this helps and this is Booker one saying off